Greetings, welcome to day four of my video blog for the Channel 4 series Ramblings of an Ex Lifeguard in the Lunatic Asylum Garden. I know. It's not been so bad here, I'm getting used to it. Uh, it's mostly the screams at night that keep me awake. But, um, the showers haven't been as bad as I thought um, and I've been doing some repair work on some bikes out here and they earn me credits or trade cigarettes for um, getting left alone in the showers if you know what I mean though sometimes it relieves the boredom so I don't leave you mind anyway what have we been doing yeah um, I've been cleaning some bikes for some of the ones that ain't ever getting over the wall. Um, and I get to speak to the birds, except the robins, they're fuckers. They've been picking on Stephen the Chaffinch. Cunts. Anyway, they're dry at the moment. Um, so. Some adverts coming up now. Um, Part two, we'll be telling you about what happened in part one. And then we'll be telling you about what's coming up in part two. Hope you're enjoying the series so far. I'm digging a tunnel. Don't tell anyone. Shh. Bye for now. Hey folks, how are you all doing? Me again. <laughs> Kicked off last night. So exciting. It was an escape. Apparently, one of the most dangerous inmate uh, resident escaped last night, but their handler, I mean their um, carer, uh, escaped. It was helicopters, dogs, all sorts. Searchlights going all over the garden. Uh, don't know any more about it. It's just codenamed Ferret. Don't know who it is. That's all you hear. Oh, this is so exciting. Ooh, anyway, more good news. Look. Channel 4 ditched us. Not suitable or something. I don't know what I'm going on about. But look, I've got picked up by a new channel. It's E4. Um, no, sorry, they're called 4Es. Never heard of them. I think there's something to do with like, wildlife and nature, maybe. Don't know. Anyway, they picked that up, me up now. And, um... Yeah, things are looking up. Oh, great. Okay, gotta go for now. Gotta plant some more seeds. Bye. Hiya. Hi guys. Well, dog in my tunnel. Told you I would. Right. Long story. I got banned from the recreation room. Won't go into that. Anyway, I dug my tunnel all the way to the shoppy. Look what I got. Java cakes. Oh no, I'm not gonna pig out any of them all. I've got plans for these big boys. Hi again folks, really good news. Jaffa Cakes worked out even better than it could be expected. You should see this, oh, I'm so excited. Here we go, look. You will not, I guarantee you won't believe this. Look, you've got to see it with your own eyes. It's flowered, look. I planted them, these special compost. See them, look. Jaffa cakes for everyone. Look, see? It's a Jaffa cake tree. What next?
my socialist dream. I can feed the world now. Oh, I can see it now. Ed Sheeran. Look. It's good. Look, Tay there. Look, Tay Tay. I'm feeding an Ethiopian child a Jaffa cake. Ooh. You've saved my life. Well done. Thank you, Ed, and all the people out there. Especially the guy that invented the Jaffa cake tree. You're my hero. See? Gonna be a household name. You saw it here first though. Real, real viewers supporting me through it all. Thank you. Bye for now. Hi guys. Um, not such good news today. Um, I found out from my informant, Aquarius, that um, Mavitis have put a contract on my head. I'm fucked. They're losing millions. Um, just gotta go deep cover. feral for a bit, living rough. I have to go off the channel for a bit. I'll let you know if it's safe to come back out again. Stay true viewers. Bye. Morning folks. Um, bit of a chilly morning today. Um, but uh, yeah, really positive. Happy today. Um, some not so good things have happened, but I don't really care. First thing to let you see is this. Mm. Secret tunnel got discovered. <clears throat> so no more little trips to shoppy, but it doesn't matter. Good news is I've got picked up for a new series with one and only Aunt Middleton. Yeah, it's this new series. <clears throat> It's going to air on uh, Channel 42 in New Zealand, so hello to all our Kiwi viewers. Um, yeah, it's, it's amazing. Wait till you hear this. Right, me and Ant, we're going out in a Black Hawk helicopter at night. Night vision goggles and everything, all that good stuff. <clears throat> and we fast stroke down into some of the most dangerous, hostile um, places in the world. Uh, like Bolivia, um, you know, places like that. And we go into like these drug lords compounds and we do secret guerrilla gardening. Yeah, we go in and we do like this, this covert gardening at night. And then we install cameras and we bug out. That's the expression they use. Uh, and then we sit and we watch the expression of all these drug lords when they wake up in the morning and their compound's been like landscape gardened sounds good anyway i'll keep you posted let you know how it's going and um hope you're all well as well um yeah garden's looking okay um some of the plants are flourishing seeing this is a gardening program i thought i should show you some of my plants some lavender it's not really the season nothing's really flowering at the moment but uh let you see all the stuff I've been growing. Um, yeah, it's the next batch of Jaffa cake trees. Um, apparently there's Jaffa cake tree virus that I didn't know about. Um, so that kind of, that plan's gone to the wall really. Um, so never mind, onwards and upwards. Right, take care. Bye now. Cheers, Ewan. Bye now. Cheers. See you later. Ewan McGregor. Hi guys. Well, that's me. You're not... Yeah, I'm going to say it again. You're not going to believe this. Ewan McGregor. Best mates. <clears throat> We're actually just back from Mogadishu. Yeah. Since my last series. Uh, so successful. Went global with um, Anne Middleton. Never thought it'd be so popular. Um, but yeah. Back to Ewan McGregor. Uh, yeah, we're just back from filming in uh, Mogadishu. Um, we were out there because apparently all the warlords got fed up of fighting and 
um, shooting 50 cars at each other. Um, so they got into like hipster cafes, um, so like skinny lattes and uh, hemp products, uh, craft beer, all that sort of stuff's really taken off in the Moog. Um, so yeah, we were out there filming. Uh, we went out there on electric motorbikes, yeah. Uh, yeah, look, and actually, if you'd have believed it, five years since we first filmed in here. Um, yeah, it's not changed that much in the garden. Um, other than that, um, the rest of the site of you know, Cornflower Hospital Asylum um, it was sold. Yeah, Dandara bought it all and turned it into a spacious new modern living or something like that. Looks like flats to me, but uh, I don't know. So, yeah, yeah, mixed thoughts coming back here. But, um, we've all got to move on in life. Successful film career. Um, got a new line of merch coming out. Uh, so, yeah, check my website. And um, again, thanks to all the viewers from the start of my videos, my blog that followed me. Um, sure, the guys that put me here. Uh, so thank you. Uh, who knows what's coming next? Take care. Bye.